Northwest Indiana waking up to snow capped streets this weekend. Low temperatures now causing some concern for ice on the road. CBS 2's Asal Razai is live in the newsroom showing you how people are digging out. Good morning to you, Asal. Good morning, Mugo. We found driving conditions to be very dangerous yesterday. The mobile weather lab sliding on interstates. We're lucky we did not get stuck in neighborhoods that had not been plowed yet. Take a look at this video. A lot of people spending the weekend digging out of the snow you see there. A lot of cars getting stuck on the streets that were snow packed. We saw at least six to eight inches of snow on streets that were waiting for plows. The lake effect snow making visibility incredibly low. Black ice, a major concern on the roads. We saw a lot of that yesterday morning, and that concern continues today. A WBBM radio reporter in Michigan City sends, says that bands of snow came in faster than plows could keep up. I was up at 4 a.m. and there was already quite a bit of snow on the cars and on the roads. Uh, and it just increased from there to the point where the intensity of this storm, according to the National Weather Service, it was two to three inches per hour. And the wind was just howling off the lake. So not only do you have big waves crashing into the shoreline here, but you have the snow coming sideways, making visibility almost impossible. And at one point in whiteout conditions, emergency crews were backed up in miles long traffic and could not get to crashes. While major interstates are reopened this morning, drivers should still watch out for black ice and blowing snow on the roads. I'm Asal Razai, live in the newsroom, CBS 2 News. Yeah, good advice there, Asal. Thank you.